moon. The most interesting facts about the Earth's satellite. Alexandra Wood. Moon. What does the moon look like, and how does it relate to Earth? In the evening, when the sun sets, the moon appears in the sky. The moon and the stars illuminate the Earth at night. What is the moon? Maybe it's a cheese wheel. Sometimes it's round, but sometimes it seems that someone has bitten it. I wonder if it's delicious. Maybe it's a silver coin. Is the moon a lemon? Today it's a whole piece of fruit. And in a few days, there is just a slice. In fact, the moon is a part of space. We all live on planet Earth, and everything that's beyond it is called space. The Earth is the third planet from the sun. The sun is a giant star that shines brightly in distant space. For us. It seems like a little celestial body that gives us daylight. The moon is the natural satellite of the Earth. It's four times smaller than our planet, and almost four hundred times smaller than the Sun. To imagine these sizes, you can put a P on the table. It will be the moon. Next to it, there is a coin. It will be Earth. Now, open a big beach umbrella over them. It will be the sun. The moon turns around our planet, and it takes 28 days to complete a full orbit around Earth. The moon also rotates on its axis and makes a full turn in 28 days. It was discovered that the moon always turns around the Earth by the same side. The face, the other side of the moon, the back, can only be seen from space. Every night, the moon changes its size and shape. Sometimes it becomes smaller and sometimes bigger, but it only seems to to us. Another amazing fact: the moon does not shine on its own. The moon is a huge gray stone covered with dust from crushed asteroids. At night, the moon reflects the light of the sun, so we think it's yellow and glows. Do you remember that the moon is moving around Earth, and that we can see only the face of the moon? Because of that, we always see different forms of the moon in the sky. Sometimes a crescent, sometimes a slice of lemon, sometimes a round coin. It depends on the angle at which the sun illuminates the moon. For example, when the moon turns its face to both Earth and the sun, we see it completely. It's called full moon. When the moon turns its back to the sun. And it is just between the Earth and the Sun. We do not see it at all. The Sun illuminates the back of the Moon, and it does not reflect sunlight on Earth. It's called new Moon. In different phases, the Sun illuminates different parts of the Moon's face. The shape we see in the sky depends on it. It seems to us that the Moon grows. Decreases and disappears, and then reappears again. The moon is important for life on Earth. The moon affects the sea level. This leads to ebb and flow. If there was no moon, the climate on Earth would be very harsh. It would be extremely cold and rainy. There would be strong winds and tornadoes. The gravity on the moon is less than on the Earth. Anybody on the moon will seem six times lighter than on the Earth. Can you count how much you'll weigh if you get to the moon? By the way, 
the first person to set foot on the moon was an American astronaut, Neil Armstrong. It happened more than 50 years ago. When he walked on the surface of the moon, he said, that's one small step for a man, one giant leap for mankind. The moon hides many riddles. To study the moon nowadays, they use space probes, special devices that transmit data from the moon to the Earth. Would you like to become an explorer or an astronaut and visit the moon? What if, when you grow up, there will be settlements for people on the moon? Would you like to live there?